so difficult is the impact they have on families and small communities. Jacksboro, Texas was one of those communities hit hard by a tornado, damaging homes and schools. Joining us now is a resident of Jacksboro, Texas, Darlene Wigington. Darlene, thank you so much for lending some of your time to talk about your experience. Yeah, okay. Uh, I, I read through part of what you went through. I had chills just thinking about how scary this must have been. So walk us through what happened from the minute you found out you had that tornado warning. What, what did you and your family, um, what did you do? Well, I was at the schoolhouse, the high school, picking up my, middle, my high school child. And my son called me and told me, Mom, get home. There's a tornado coming after us. And I said, no, there's not. I thought he was playing with me because he's, he's a joker. He likes to do stuff like that. And then we heard the, the sirens and I said, oh, Lord. Oh, so we barely, me and two of my children barely got home. And then my youngest son and my husband barely got in. We barely got in the house before. It was just right up on us. It was horrible. How, I've never seen anything like it. <laughs> so how many of you were huddled in your home? There was 12 of us. I have uh, seven. I have seven of my grandchildren and then my husband and I and my two oldest boys. And, you know, we've been hearing from survivors from tornadoes. Um, you know, the thing yesterday that really struck me was one man saying he felt the house shaking and then it was seconds. Um, it felt like that it was over him. How would you describe the moment that tornado went over you guys? It definitely shook. I mean, it's like you take it. And, uh, I mean, it 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 shook. I mean, it scared it. I've never been scared that much, but my children were screaming, and I mean, it was scary. It was really scary, and the noise was unbelievable. I mean, unbelievable. We are so fortunate. You are so fortunate to be okay, right? So everybody's okay. Want to also clear that up. Everybody was able to walk away from this. Um, but what about your home? What's left of that? I was one of the blessed ones. My home didn't get the near the damage that, you know, the path was just maybe, what, 100 yards from us. So I didn't get near the damage. I mean, we lost our our carport and our dog kennels, as you can see, and the little house off to the left of us, that's ours. It lost its some of its roof. Uh, the new car in the drive, it's damaged. Um, that was my father my father-in-law's home. It has severe damage. And well, that's my son's boat. <laughs> I'll flipped upside yeah. down. So the community, yeah. I mean, the community was hit hard. Um, you know, before we have to leave you, how is the community? How are you doing? And what do you guys need most at this time? Well, right now they're doing a lot of pairs on our, our lines and stuff. And I mean, there's just like, um, how many miles? Oh, from 7th, 8th, 9th, 10th, 11th, all the way up into the, the new edition. I mean, it's just wiped out. I mean, I've never, it's, dev it's devastating. It's, it really is devastating. I'm, I've never seen anything like this. And our kids are still, you know, out of school. Uh, our elementary got hit hard and our high school got hit hard. And I was just thinking, you know, I just picked my, my middle child up from the high school and uh, they was trying to get us to stay and go in. And I said, no, I got other children at home. I need to go mm -hmm. home. So we come home and just, you know, wrote it out. Well, we are so glad you're okay, that your seven grandchildren, that your children, you guys were able to cling to each other and stay safe from this tornado. But obviously it was a matter of minutes for you guys to really act and get to safety. So, you know, we wish you the best of luck as you really try to put the pieces back together and get through this. But I, I think the big thing is everyone is okay and the best, that's the best thing you can ask for. So. Yes, we're we're okay. We've got we've got a lot to rebuild, and uh, our community's got a lot to rebuild, and we're a strong mm -hmm. community, and we're going to get it done. You most certainly are. We're going to be following your story as we continue uh, in the next several weeks. Uh, Darlene, thank you again. I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way, so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.